Here we are at Twin Lakes Campground, and I want to take this video to show you the hookup of the trailer to our four-door Jeep. And as you can see, you can tow this thing with a pretty small SUV. It's really lightweight and about 3,500 pounds. And here's what it looks like all hooked up. I don't know, let's walk around and show it to you here. It's kind of in travel mode, so to speak. Not necessarily in its mode for, you know, for camping anyway, but we're going to show you. There's another video we'll have on that one here. Anyway, this is all rigged up for, for travel. See, so it hooks up pretty easy with our, our lift there. And let's move back here to the front. And you can see it here. So it's actually a pretty good setup. Rides real easy. Yeah, mirrors on the side too. So, you know, where's that's it. Okay, uh, we got one more video for you to see, which will be in a campground. Okay, we'll see you later. Bye bye. Here we are, the charter set up in our storage area and got everything up here. And I'll kind of go around and show you the stuff we have with the trailer. It's got a electric jack, as you can see up front here. There's a handle to turn if you want, and two tanks. And it's also got a regulator, which you can see right there in the middle. It basically let you know when uh, when things are you know you gotta switch tanks wheel comes with it that you, that you put down and back over here we have kind of set up over here now you can see right now these are the two inputs for the uh, the antenna or the cable uh, the one on the left is what I put in uh, about a year ago and you know, then the cable double cable comes with it plus the hose it's got a uh, uh, pressure reducer there make sure things are okay as you can see down there it's got a, a you know, pretty nice I put a, a, a I put this Camco connectors up there so it make it easier to hook up so it comes with that and it comes with the, the hoses there and then a little snake that goes on to plus the end piece and of course back over here of course is the 30 amp connector and uh, back here as you can see I put these I made these things for the back because, as you can see, the hoses themselves, <laughs> there's no way the hoses are going to fit into that 4-inch thing right there without the, without the connector head. So I built this thing, this device on the, on the top, so the hoses go in one side and stay on there. And over here, of course, is the other end. And then what you see here is the canopy. The canopy is really nice, real clean. And uh, if you see this thing on the uh, on the right here, this is why we're selling <laughs> selling our, our rig here. So then over here, now you can see the containers there. It's a baggage compartment there. And uh, this is a device that you can use to change flat tires. As we move over here, we don't want to show you this here. Shot here. This is the bed with the bed up, uh, propped up, and that develops that flat device there to hold it up. Uh, what you see here. As a crank for the, you know, for the jacks, and you can use a, uh, you can also use a rechargeable drill. This is a brand new uh, stabilizer right there for the, uh, for the canopy, and then this is the anti sway bar if you want to use that. Down below here we have a 50 to 30 adapter, and then also a 30 to, to 110 adapter, and this is a, a particular gauge you can use to lift your, uh, your uh, propane tanks to see if they're, uh, they're uh, full or not. So. That's about it for the. Well, now we just stepped inside the trailer, and the first thing you see here is a uh, uh, TV mount that I put in, and so that it connects to the uh, right down here is the cable connects to that that other cable connection I put in. Um, it actually uh, it connects right to the cable connection, but also I'm providing this particular antenna. So in case you have to hook up to antenna just to air, you can use that. Also, as you can see, what comes with it is I've got all the manuals right here that come for, with the, the trailer and also all the equipment that, uh, that are contained here. Uh, there's also another power uh, hookup right down here, too, that I put in. Going around here, as you can see, we'll go back here. You can see it's real nice through here. Nothing magic about it. Really a super nice little rig. Back here, uh, we have another situation. We've got a back down there is probably going to put another power connection and hook it up right here. And uh, this table drops down to make a bed. There's storage room under here and under here. And then uh, 
obviously this is where you have your hookup here for your back TV that comes with it you have the air or in the on um, in cable and the refrigerator is really big it's a full-size refrigerator if I can open it up here for you and you can see it's a pretty nice one here and we'll go ahead and shut that <laughs> and keep on going here the other thing I want to show you is the bathroom it's got a really nice bathroom one of the things we put in here was it had a regular shower curtain put one of these extended shower curtains in for you that are really kind of nice it swivels back and forth so that's included also new things were installed so other than that uh, that's about it for the, the inside of the trailer curtain here so uh, that's about it if you got any questions again it's got a you know you can see it's got a double sink here and a microwave and a stove and an oven and I think that's about it of course obviously air conditioning and heat which is really important obviously <laughs> anyway hope you like it and talk to you later if you want to interested okay see you later bye, -bye.